The wings of dragonflies and damselflies are composed of super lightweight porous materials. As a fly emerges from water, CO2 gas in the wings is thought to maintain the pressure, keeping these structures intact. Synthesis of aerogels, the lightest solids known to man, could take inspiration from this ambient approach. In their article in Advanced Materials, Dr. Zhao Han and Dr. Lydia Schiller from Newcastle University, UK, and their co-workers from Ambar University, Iraq, the University of Limerick, Ireland, the National Museum of Bosnia and Herzegovina, and Durham University, UK, report a new ambient drying method for aerogel fabrication. The aerogel manufacture is currently limited by the drying process because conventional drying methods from wet gel to aerogel require either specifically pressurized chamber or expensive drying solvents. We were inspired by scanning electron microscopy of dragonfly wings, which show aerogel structure and images of the level of the dragonflies out of the water. So we designed a new chemical joint process to generate carbon dioxide gas inside the wet gel by pushing liquid out of the wet gel. Trimethyl chlorosilane was added to the wet gel containing a sodium bicarbonate solution, causing the production of CO2 gas. This gas becomes trapped in the aerogel pores, resisting pore collapse during drying and resulting in a monolithic aerogel. Durable and freestanding layered silica aerogels were also made using this approach. Our future work is toward manufacturing of various aerogel building products, which we believe will bring large energy savings to our society. To find out more about this ambient drying method for aerogels, please visit the Advanced Materials homepage.